Once, we were part of Great Caesar's tribe, but then soldiers came. Many apes died, and we fled. Led by father, we crossed rivers and mountains, walked for many moons. Until we found this mountain, this home, our sanctuary. Somewhere we could live in peace. But now winter is coming. And there is no more food here. Apes are starving. We must find food somewhere soon. <laughs> yes, brother. Think before you speak. Tom Ross, he was a good leader of this town, a fair leader. <laughs> Some of us didn't always agree with him, but when things got bad, he led us all. Now his wife, Jess, has agreed to carry his work on. Let us hope God is with her and us. Laid low by illness, but a fighter till the end. Rest easy, friend. You okay? Yeah. I always 
I saw Tom would outlive all of us. Difficult days ahead. For you and for all of us. Are you gonna be okay? Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, Maria. Jess. This loss. It's not just yours. No. I know. People like Tom. He was a strong leader. It's what Millerton needed. It's what this town needs now. Winter is coming. Someone's gonna have to make some tough decisions. You really think that's you? The town asked me to take over, Rainy. I got this. Yeah, hey, uh, I guess we'll find that out. Do you really know what we got in store for winter? Whether we're prepared or not. I know we have to work together. The hard days ahead, Jess. I get it. Cold, snow, food in short supply. Mark. Please stop. You're giving me orders? Now you're in charge? That's not fair. I miss you, Dad, too. I still can't believe you're running this place now. You're not the only one. Come on. It's enough now. My sons, Tola, Bren, Juno, the first snow has fallen. The tribe is hungry, scared. We must show them we are strong. Tola, you will lead the hunt tonight and take Bren. Tribe see brothers strong together. Yes, father. I will follow Tola. Like humans, we can kill too. Enough! You will do as I say. Hunt together. Bring food for tribe. I get eight stuff.
Juno is no good for this. What is Juno good for? My sons will hunt together. Yes, you can see, huh? It's not enough. You're right, it's not. It's a big problem. What about the flour? Uh, Tom said there were cases of powdered milk, other stuff. I guess Tom didn't want to worry you. Question is, what are you gonna do? We're gonna have to watch this stuff, rationing down the road, and your men keep close eyes on the livestock. Yeah, yeah, all that. But still, this is not a pretty picture. Are you gonna tell people that? No. I keep this quiet for now. Yeah, I agree. People here have gone through a lot, Jess. You're their leader. Better watch how you lead. Jess! Come take a look! Riders, two of them. Doesn't look good. You in a hurry to start a fight? We don't know a damn thing about these two, Jess. Don't think they're gonna like having a rifle aimed at them. That's close enough! Well, I guess you can see my friend here is hurt bad. And who do I have the pleasure of addressing? What do you want? Straight to business, okay. Well, I'm Jacob Willits. And my wounded friend here that's Oswald Reeves. Yeah. Caught in an accident. <coughs> He's hurting bad. Jess Ross. I'm in charge here. Yeah, I gathered that. So you think you might be able to help us? What did you have in mind, Mr. Willits? Well, I'd like to tend to my friend's wounds. Get a roof over our heads a few nights, some water feed for our horses. Maybe we'll do some work for you in exchange. What are you doing out here? We're just drifters, Miss Ross, trying to stay alive. We don't get many strangers. What the hell brought you to Millerton? Uh, things got bad out there, you know? Hunger, disease, and dying. There's a lot of scared people. People who want what somebody else has. And we're a lot better off uh, on our own. You all right? Yeah, I think so. 
What do you say, Jess? I don't like the looks of these guys. And we haven't got food to spare. Wait a minute. That man's hurt. And you want us to turn our backs on them. I don't want to take the risk. They look like trouble. Come on, Jess. Get them in. Now. I can't let you in. Jess. I can't take any chances. Don't leave a man to bleed out in the dirt. I won't let you do it. Yes, Clarence. I know. I will do my best.
tonight we hunt on the plains. Tonight we bring food for the tribe! Humans. <laughs> Humans will see us. Humans bad. Humans bad. <laughs> Father said. Father said. said
Shit, Mikey. Someone's out there. I'm in danger. This is your fault, Tolo. Yours are still human food. We find much food for tribe. Good steer! Oh. Mikey, you're gonna be okay. Yeah, sure. Maria's gonna fix you. You'll be okay. Rainy, that hurt. What if we've lost it? Jess, I need to get him inside. Hang on, Maria. We gotta find out what's happened. Mark, medical kit. Now. Just tell us what happened, son. Me and Pete. We were with the herd by the creek. Some something spooked him. <laughs> Took feet. Y'all gonna think I'm crazy, but it was an ape. What? You say you saw an ape? Yeah, no, I mean, uh, uh more than one, apes. <laughs> <laughs> Take it easy. Mikey? Mikey. <laughs> what about the herd? What about Pete? I told you! A goddamn ape killed Pete! Apes! Apes, man! Take it easy. Calm down. Mark, pressure on. Yes, we gotta get out there. Find Pete and check on the cattle. In the dark? Are you crazy, Rainy? <laughs> no, you're right. We gotta find Pete and we gotta find the steer. I need to get this bullet out now. I need some help, Give the dark a hand! All right, folks, get back to bed. There's nothing more to see. Jess, I gotta show you something. Willits and Reeves saddlebags, I checked them. You're not gonna believe what I found.
I don't think you've been entirely honest with us. Because you sure as hell ain't who you say you are. I guess it's time we came clean, eh, Oswald? Fact is, we didn't want to scare you guys unnecessarily. But we're, uh... What's it called? Ape hunters. <laughs> You're what? We aren't apes since the flu. Somehow they got out, they got smart. Bred like rats. Use guns. Guns? Yup. Shoot you real dead, too. Wow. Your wounds mighty improved. Oh yeah, how about that? I guess I'm one of those lucky types. Heals fast. <laughs> Apes, they are a scourge. They've been heading east. We've been tracking them. See, what we do is we find a tribe and we rob them out. And people are usually pretty grateful. Surprisingly grateful. So you knew about these apes, and you didn't warn us. I wouldn't say we knew you had an ape problem. Fact is, we thought you folks might be fine out here. I guess now we've changed our minds about that. Okay, I get it. These apes are dangerous. So what do we do? Hunt them down? Drive them out of the valley? Yeah, I appreciate that vote of confidence, but the thing is, we don't know how bad your ape problem is. Could be a whole army of them out there. And I'm guessing you folks don't have a damn clue what you're gonna face. So for us, come morning, we're turning south. Yeah, you're right. We don't have a clue. But maybe you do, so why don't you share what you know, huh? Yeah, maybe next time. If there is a next time. Your town, none too friendly either. I think you can sort this out. All right, I get it. Couple of punk drifters, all talk. Come on, Jess, let's get out of here. Ooh, ah, 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 Ma'am, Mr. Rainey, you really want our help, you know what, we'll help. But here's the thing, you need to listen to us and do exactly what we say, when we say it, or more people are gonna die. It's your call, Jess. Yeah, we'll listen. But let's get one thing straight, you don't call the shots, I do. Okay, we'll help you. Not right now. We're gonna get some sleep. <clears throat> but come tomorrow, though, we'll track us some apes. Hell, maybe even kill a few. <laughs> Y'all shut the door, we're getting a little bit of a draft in here. <laughs> Oh, oh, 
Yes. Tribe.
Did you see humans? Yes. There were two. Did you hurt them? We had to kill one. The other... Escaped. Oh, my sons are fools. You put the tribe in danger! Close. Y'all better be ready. Willet, what do you know about these apes? No. No, they'll rip you in two. I'll tell you this, though. They go down with a headshot. Anything else, you better empty that clip. But if we hit them hard, they'll run, right? Just leave. Run. No. We meet up with them. We're in for a nasty fight. You want to know what to do if one of them grabs you? Let me guess, Reeves. Kiss your ass goodbye. <laughs> Something like that.
What happened? They attacked us. They ran off. We beat them. Yeah, maybe. We should get the hell out of here. is close. We can still... What the hell happened? We found the apes all right. Tracked them straight into an ambush. Where's Isaac? I I'm sorry. Isaac didn't make it. Two dead in 24 hours. God, Jess. I know, and they're still out there. But for now, we have to take care of everyone here. Jess! We gotta start protecting ourselves and fast. Get people looking for waves that apes can break into this town. Okay. I'll get people to help, but we have to take precautions. All right. Jess, we gotta get this town safe again. Now, it could be Oswald and I help you with that. I thought you might have ideas. Let's hear him. Look, when the apes find you, and they will find you, they're gonna come after you. So unless you got guns on all these walls, and I do mean all these walls, it's just a matter of time before they're in here. 
Okay, but hang on. We can't just hole up in here, waiting. We need to send out patrols. <laughs> He's right. What are we supposed to do? Sit on the wall 24-7, guns pointed at nothing? We send out patrols. <laughs> patrols? But you must be ape hunters. Securing Millerton's a priority. We take care of our people. It's a good decision, Jess. You two thinking you'll stay? Got some good people in this town. Hate to see things go wrong. Yeah, I think we will stay. Sure. In the meantime, we'll go outside and check out ways the mapes could maybe get in here. What can I do?
Brutus! Rainy, what's going on? Jess, you've seen what those apes can do. I figure we need to use everything we got. Otherwise, next time. Wait a second, Rainy. You're handing these out? To the whole compound. It's overkill. Better safe than dead. Especially if we go after them right where they live. We're not going anywhere. Not for now. This is war, Jess! We don't have a damn choice here. It's kill them, or they are gonna kill us. No. We do have a choice. No one wants more bloodshed. So, we just sit back, and we wait for them. That your plan? The apes attacked us because we attacked them. Can't you see that? I'll make the calls, Rainy. You just make sure you and your men are on board. Here. At least carry a decent weapon. All right. For defense. All right, it's your call, but yes, God. If you're wrong, and they come for us. If I'm wrong, then we'll fight them off. And then we'll follow them back into the forest, find their camp, and then we'll hunt them down like rats. is dead! Tola is leader now!
I just don't get it, Mom. You should have Willis and Reeves organizing things. They've done this before. They know how to kill apes. They're lucky they showed up. They talk a good story, Mark. But the fact is, the apes are still out there. And they can hit us at any time. Sooner or later, we're gonna have to kill them, not the ape hunters. Well, they're still here. Counts for something, I guess.
They're drifters. We have to make our own decisions. I'm just saying. Look. Before he got sick, Dad used to make the tough calls around here. And the town always followed him. But maybe people don't know if you can make those kind of decisions. Like with these apes. If it turns into... war. What are you gonna do? I'll do whatever I have to do to keep you safe. To keep our home safe. Maybe you just gotta think, you know? What would Dad do? Listen, Mark. I'm trying my best. Please believe that. Mom? Mark, take over. What's going on? I need to get down to the generator. You stay up here. I'm coming too. Here, take this. But you stay up here. No way, you need a gun. I'm coming. I'm telling you to stay up here. You keep ringing the alarm if anything happens, you have a gun. Mark, I love you.
Not fight hard enough. <clears throat> Kill enough. Juno. Huh? Clarence. Juno hides. You know. Hold on. We must go back and find him and have more ape die for that old fool. No! No!
What the hell? We brought you something. Just need to ask this little fella some questions. What do you mean, it can talk? Only one way to find out. <laughs> Look, I'm guessing you know numbers. How about you give us one? How many apes are there? Well, it's... Whatever you're doing, it's not working. Jess, here's the thing. See Oswald's face? Ape attack. Reeves was able to get away, but his daughter? Yeah, his daughter wasn't so lucky. Tore my little girl apart. Seven years old, she was. Mm. Spitting image of a mom. And it was all my fault. You see, we had an ape prisoner. <laughs> we were too damn soft on it. <laughs> Just that ape knew that other apes were coming, but wasn't talking. It seems to me we're in a similar situation right now. We need information. So what's it gonna be? Come on, Jess. Enough. It can't talk. <gasps> Maria's right. If this ape knows anything, it's not talking. <laughs> You've got to stop this. It's wrong and it's getting us nowhere. Four dead tonight, Jess. And you can't spill a damn drop of ape blood. Well, it's Reeves, that's enough. You're going to kill him. And what good will that do? Stop! Today, Ape died at human hands. But we got into their town, killed humans blood for blood. Human will seek revenge. Want to kill Ape? Hunt us down. Tell us all. But this human mistake, because when they come, we will be ready! <laughs> Obey Brutus, and victory will be ours! <laughs>
I stay. you so what the hell are we gonna do I sure ain't sitting around waiting for the apes to come back there's only one thing to do go after them right Out there hunting for them, who knows what we'll face. I say we stay here. We're safer behind these walls. Come on, Jess, really? After what happened last night? Oh yeah? This how things get decided now? Come in, nothing's been decided yet. So... Let's say we do go after these apes. We know there's at least a half dozen of them. It means we need a lot of guns we're gonna get the job done. We kill everything we find. Exactly. Did I miss something? We don't know how many of them there are. Back in the Marines, we'd take our time. Figure out what we're dealing with. <laughs> oh yeah? Well, I'm sure back in the Marines, you never went up against an army of apes. Huh? I don't think so. We go in fast, and we get them all. She's right. We don't know what's out there. Let's take a vote. Who says we do a recon first? Majority rules. <laughs> Get your people together, Rainy. Good shots. People with guts, because it ain't gonna be pretty out there. Okay, we leave at dawn. Let's get all set. There aren't gonna be any of us getting much sleep tonight. I'm going too. No, you're not. This is my town as well. I'm going. We sure could use a dock up there. People in here need me too. I'll be here when you get back. Jess, I have something to show you. Now. This is Jess. He understood what you said. Can he speak? He speaks a form of sign language. Rain comes. Winter comes. Apes want food. Apes need food. Apes Apes don't want killing. Apes 
want. Peace. Peace, Jess. He's talking about peace. If we let him go, he can tell his tribe that we want peace too. You believe him? Think about it. If we let him go, we have a chance to avoid more bloodshed. Keep him. They'll just come back. It's war. I don't know. Jess. Hey, Mom, we're almost ready. I got your... Thanks. What's going on? Nothing. We're just checking in on the ape. We're saddling up. We gotta go. Okay, I'll be right there. If the ape stays here, they'll kill him. Okay. You keep him safe. Keep moving. Fresh tracks. Be alert. Yeah. Well, it's an ape camp, all right. There's our way in. The old silver mines. We going in? No. We circle around. Take till nightfall to circle around. You want to be up here in dark? No, we circle around. Find another way in. Too long, Jess. They're my people, my decision. Kay, mm -hmm. stay with the horses. Mark with us. Got it. Okay, hot shot. You want to take point, head on into the cave, go right ahead. We're gonna wait right here. No. We go in, you go with us. All right. We'll watch your back. Good.
move, move, move! Coming, so what the hell do we do now? You really want to talk about how we got here? We're gonna talk about how we get the hell out, cause not that way. They're waiting for us. Pal, I'm gonna have to snap it off. Ready? On three. All right. One. Ah! Good man. Okay, let's see if we can get you to stand. Give me your hand. Mark, you good? Yeah. Rainy, it seems pretty quiet out there. Maybe only chance to make a run for it. Yeah, maybe they've gone. Yeah. You try and make a run for the horses. Mom, I used to come up here with Dad. There's another way out. This is already bad enough. That's exactly where they want you to go. Mark, you lead the way.
breathe. Waterfall! Ma! Yes, got no time. Gotta go! No! <laughs> to talk. We have to talk. I don't want to hear it, Rainy. Jess, please explain to me what happened. Where's Mark? I should have been able to save him, but the apes got him. The apes got my son. What the hell? Rainy? I had to save Jess. It was too late for Mark. It was chaos. We walked right into an ambush. They were waiting for us. But Willits and Reeves should have known. So much for our goddamn ape hunters. They let us down. I won't make the same mistake again. So you're saying we're better off without them? I don't know, maybe we are. What do you think, Rainy? My gut tells me don't trust them. Never have. And what makes you think we trust you, Rainy? I don't know, he's right. I feel the same. Hey! You gotta see this. The ape. They're stringing him up! No! Don't do this! Are you kidding me? After what just happened? The last thing we need in this town is a goddamn ape! Yeah, he killed your people! Now we kill him, and y'all get to watch! Jess, are you gonna let this happen? Willits, killing this ape solves nothing! Are we all done talking here? Listen. Listen. The apes have Mark, but we have this ape. Kill him, and you've got nothing. I know you're right. We cannot let what happened go unanswered. We'll be over soon. Tell them to stop, Jess. Yes, the ape should pay, but this ape alive could be worth something. Listen! Look, I don't know how, but maybe this ape can help me get my son back. 
So I'm gonna tell you one thing. We do not kill this ape now. All right! This stops now! Until we figure things out, cut him down. It's a bad decision, Jess. All right, folks. Looks like the show's over for now. You and I need to talk. Reeves. We've got to let this ape go free. Sooner, later, they'll kill him. The apes killed our people and took my son. Why would I let it go? Kill my friend, Clarence. He was wise, ape! Did you see him die? I, I don't know. A lot of apes died. Oh, oh. Clarence, special ape, not look like other apes. The orangutan. <laughs> no, wait, we, we, we caught him. He, he's alive. <gasps> Clarence lives! <gasps> if Clarence lives, the tribe can use this human to get him back! Yes! We must use this human to trade for Clarence! If we can trade with humans, then maybe we can have peace with humans too! Peace! Peace! Hoaka speaks truth! Die. 
you back at the compound, Jess. Come on. You have my friend, Clarence. Oh. How do you know that? Mark's alive. No lie. Boy is alive. Oh. Safe. With us. Not bad. Not like my friend. <laughs> oh, metal bridge near mountain. Oh, oh, first sun tomorrow. You bring Clarence. We mean boy. Yes. be there. We'll be there. If you come, maybe bring Jess peace. Human. And you believe this ape talking deals? Peace? You trust them? Yeah. Yeah, I think I do. I mean, it makes sense. I was open. Just a private party. Wait, I'm talking to Rainey. Look, I get it. What happened out there, lynch mob, not your style. But we can still help you. Just tell us what's going on.
You want to tell him? An ape came, talked to Jess. Says Mark's alive. They want to swap Mark for the ape. First light tomorrow, Miller's Bridge. Says maybe peace deals too. You want my advice? Take it. You take that deal. <laughs> Don't tell me you trust a goddamn ape. Wait. Let's hear him out. You want your son back? You want peace? You take the deal. You take that meeting. Meanwhile, Oswald and I are thinking we could bring in some friends from outside the valley. People who know apes know how to kill apes. Think of it like insurance, backup plan for the bridge. So what are you saying? You're bringing in more people, more ape hunters. What are you talking about? I wouldn't bring them in unless you want them, but I know you need them. So it's up to you to decide if you want that help. Things do go south, Jess. No. No, I, I don't want them. I think we're better off on our own. Guess the answer's no, Willits. Seems your help always comes with a high price tag. It's your call. It's your son, like you said. Just trying to make sure these apes don't wipe out your nice little town here. You listen. I want my boy back. But I don't want to risk any more lives. I think Rainey's men have got this. Look, these apes aren't going to be waiting there with balloons and cake for you. You know what? It's not our problem anymore. Reeves. Fine morning. Oh. Yeah, it's like I said. Think of us as backup. You won't even over there. Yeah! Well. You have a nice day now! Willits and his men. Let's hope they stay there. is alive. Oh, <laughs> 
Come on, baby. Come on. Mark, please come on. No, 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 no. Don't you die. You didn't waste any time getting back. Well, figured someone ought to keep an eye on a nice little town here. Just open the gate. Mark needs help now. I guess y'all just send your thank you cards later then. You seem to forget we just saved your ass. You son of a bitch. Saved us! What the hell was that back there? People are dead because of you. Our people are the only reason your people are still alive. That's how you see it, not me. Listen, get your people together and get out. You're done here. Come on, well, let's open the goddamn gates. We got wounded to tend to, dead to bury. Oh, I guess y'all didn't hear that. Yeah, we got no doctor here. Maria's not with you. Last I saw, she was under some pretty heavy fire on that bridge. Get some problems. Just keep on coming, don't they?
What is this? What's going on? Things have changed, Jess. The ape threat is no longer just your problem. I think my men are here to stay. You don't get to decide that. This is my town, my people. You're upset. I can understand that, but I think with a clearer head, you'll see that my men are really the only thing between you and being wiped out. No damn way. You get your men the hell out of here, Willits. <sighs> we don't want you here. It's like I said, this is our town. You heard her, now get the hell out. Well, well, well. Now, how is that for gratitude, Oswald? <laughs> and Jess, after all you've been through, I think maybe a little time out will help you reconsider your position, your options. Are you happy now? I am. Thank you for asking, Rainy. Well, I guess it's quarantine for you two. Well, you know the way. You too, sweetheart. Stand up. Lola makes mistakes. You should be leader. Yes. Find him at bridge, fighting for human.
Hey, Doc. How you like your new home? Why am I here? Why are there humans in cages? Oh, those guys, yeah. They got sick. I won't help you. <laughs> Go to hell. Hell? <laughs> well, I think you're already there. alive. Jess brought your friend alive. But there were apes hiding, waiting to trap us, kill us. Your leader lied. Talked of trade. Not killing. me prisoner. They want to take over the town. Then take over your tribe. Oh, oh. <laughs> Soldiers. Same as you. Want to kill apes. did not betray you. Free me and we can warn her. These soldiers are heading out soon. I've heard them. Let me out. Together, we can beat them. But we have to act fast. This is not gonna end well. Rainy! We've got to get out of here. Well, that's not gonna be too damn easy. 
Let me know when you cracked it. Men grabbed me on the bridge, took me away. Willis and Reeves, they're not just ape hunters. They've got a trainload of soldiers heading this way, aiming to take over the town tomorrow. Bryn freed me. This doesn't make any sense. What I saw, apes in cages, Humans, too. Guns, explosives. They're gonna take over here, then go slaughter the apes. We've gotta do something. Do something. Take a look around. There's not many options. See, <clears throat> you think you can rebuild this country with a bunch of survivalists like you, Rainy? <laughs> nice townspeople, no goddamn way. Needs planning, strong leaders. Hell, one leader. I think that's you, Willits. Go to hell. I'm just doing what has to be done. I think your people see that. It's that good old Rainy here, I guess. They think you're ready to work with us? Against these damn dirty apes? Because I know that there's a little boy in the infirmary that would just love See his mom. He's gonna be fine, by the way. Just let us out of here and we can talk, but not like this. See, here I was thinking that after what we've been through, you'd be ready to listen to reason. Guess I was wrong. Enough bullshit, Willits! You still don't get it, do you? I'll be back to check in on you. Maybe not. Coming, we can't fight alone. It's either give it up now, give Willits to town, or. Jess. I don't know. You two think this is a shot we gotta take? Yeah. Then we fight together.
I know just the spot. The old coal tower in the valley sits over the rails. Back in the day, trains always had to slow. No better place for an ambush. You bring as many apes as you can, and we stop that train before it even gets near the town. <laughs> so let's make a plan. We blow up those tracks just as the train hits the tower. Me and my men, we're with you on this. Still, it's gonna be a long shot, but it's the only shot we got. Yeah, it could work. We got a lot of C4 in the armory. I get all my people, whoever the hell's left. I'm gonna get Mark. He comes with us. Nah, best I do that. My men are there. I go, there's no questions. You, Maria, get the explosives. C4. Wire. Okay. You good? Good. Oh, hey, Doc. I expect to see you here. Put the gun down. I said put the gun down! And the other one. What's in the bag, Miss Ross? What's in the bag, Miss Ross? C4. What do you plan on doing with C4? Sure you're up to this? Yeah. All thought out. <laughs> it's move, Mark. Yeah. Walk. You have seen many soldiers come, many guns, but I've... it is war. <laughs> But we will not fight alone. Humans will fight with us against the soldiers. Fight with human. 
No! I kill human. Obey. Oh, oh, oh. 
Right here. It's perfect. Those the apes? Better be. If they're not, we're in big trouble. Take cover now! For more men. We gotta blow the tracks now. You gonna be okay? I live. You gotta do it now. Go. Here? Yeah. 
I'll get back to Rainy. Okay. All armed. I gotta say I admire the ambition. <laughs> but this is as far as you're gonna get. Just put it down. You're not gonna get away with this. Oh, I don't know, Well, it's Even with a damn army, you still screw up. Mom. Do it. Are you okay? Yeah. Can you get up? Yeah. Quick, get up! Uh, we need to move! Move! To Rainy!
Gotta say I admire the ambition. <laughs> but this is as far as you're gonna get. Just put it down. You're not gonna get away with this. Oh, I don't know, Well, it's Even with a damn army, you still screw up. Mom, what are you doing? Move. Get up. Move. Walk. Walk! There. See? Everything's fine now. Gotta say I admire the ambition, <laughs> but this is as far as you're gonna get. Just put it down. You're not gonna get away with this. Oh, I don't know, Well, it's 
Even with a damn army, you still screw up. Drop it! Jess! How are you doing? Good. Keeping busy. 
Good for you. How are you doing? Compared to what? <laughs> <laughs>